poor daughter. She doesn't have much of a future with the world in this state. Who knows what's in the air? This pollution is so thick. Who knows what it's doing to her fragile body? Hey Miranda, how's it going? Man, the weather is bad. The weather is always bad with the environment in this state. Well, actually, can you please true. pass me a nappy? Little one needs to be changed. Okay, sure. Oh, my poor daughter. She doesn't have much of a future with the world in this state. You know what? I think it is her fault. Her fault? Yeah. How could it be her fault? She's less than one year old. All right, it is your fault. My fault? Yes, it's not my fault, it is your fault. Because they're plastic nappies. Yes, because you chose this pampers for your daughter and after she used it, it will be just a waste. And when it's waste, it will just pollute the air and environment. Oh, I don't want to play this game anymore, Soggy. It's really depressing me. Let's go back to 2008. Yeah, okay, I agree. I don't like it either. Okay, well, let's clean up this mess also. I agree with you. Yeah, let's just clean it up. Hi there. Welcome to the Voice Box Show. Sorry to begin the show on such a depressing note, but we have to be really serious about the environment. For hundreds of years here in Mongolia, we've been living, in, uh, living with the environment, and we live with the environment with harmony. However, in the past century, the pressure to develop economically has caused detriment to the environment. That's right. And it is really dangerous right now with the climate, with this old environmental problems. Hey, Miranda, do you know that it is just a doll? Yes, I know it's just a doll. Would okay. you like a, a hole? Okay, I'll do it. Yeah. So cute. <laughs> cute <doll. laughs> oh, well, there is hope. And this is what you said about your attitudes to the environment. Hi all, my name is Amosla. I'm studying Washington School and I'm ninth grade. Hi everybody, my name is Hongor. I'm 15 years old. I'm studying Washington School 9A grade. My name is Ikhim Chargal and I'm studying Washington in 9A grade. Hi, my name is Susanar and I study at Washington School at 9A grade. And I'm 15 years old. My name is Erin Zoya, and my hobby is swimming, collecting stickers, and modeling. Uh, I wear a strong feeling about the environment uh, because uh, air pollution and water pollution is a very uh, is a big problem. Well, it's a big problem in Mongolia. I think the biggest problem is like. Uh, trashes in the streets in Mongolia, uh, like because because people are uh, throwing their trashes in the street, and because there's there there isn't many rubbish bins, so uh, I wanted to tell everybody to uh, put their trashes in trash bins in the street. Uh, I think the environment is quite cool, but not cool also. I think the environment is so bad. In Mongolia, the environment is not like that good much. I think feel it so bad. Everybody is throwing garbage to the land and burn, burning the garbage so the air pollution is so up. I really uh, sick of that because uh, there, there is uh, air pollution and water pollution and land, land pollution. In Mongolia, the air pollution is very year by year it's dirty and water you know the Tor river it's year by year in the dirty in the winter time it's very air pollution in the winter because all the girls in mongolia they're just making fire and the fire goes up and makes the air pollution and sometimes the water comes up yellow strange and all of those stuff are making mongolia bad i think the people is doing the pollutions because we're we're using the chemical products and we're uh, throwing uh, stuff to the lands and to water. Uh, please don't use uh, chemical products or goods. Uh, please don't use the plastic uh, papers and plastic uh, bottles and don't throw litters. Not to burn garbage and throw garbage only in the trash box. 
don't wash car in the river and the job. Everybody has to do their own stuff like stop littering like Mongolia. The government has to care also. The government has to give lots of uh, cans and never throw cans, never use plastic, plastic papers and stuff like that. A long, 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 long time ago, before you and me, before cars, before television, before Genghis Khan even. The Earth kept itself company. There were hills that huddled together. There were the winds that ran through them, whispering all sorts of nonsense. There was the sun that watched over them all. And most important, there was a river that wound around everything. This particular river's name was Tool. Tool was just a young river, full of energy, clear and pure. Tool would splash about Mongolia, playing with all the animals and giving every living thing nourishment. Eventually, humans showed up. Tool didn't mind. She enjoyed having new friends. They got on fantastically. They took only what they needed from her. Yay! People were always coming and going, as they were what we call nomadic. Tool saw many things as time flew by. She witnessed life. Battles! Death! many celebrations. Finally, people began to settle in one place. They built a city called Ulaanbaatar. The smarter humans got, the more technology was built. And cities like Ulaanbaatar became more and more <laughs> industrialized. Chemicals from factories bled into her Rubbish choked her. Excess building forced her banks to weaken. And the saddest part of all was that the people forgot all the things that she had done for them. They forgot all about the special connection that they shared. And this is where we find her today. In a bad way. If we continue treating her the way that we have been, then one day, she will be no more. Remember that what you do affects Tool. We must take great care of her. <laughs> <laughs>